Sister Alicia, Alicia Young, for prayer, Alicia. together for Jesus. Amen. 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 Hey, you may be seated. Amen. As we go right into our baby dedication, preachers, would you come down quickly? Amen. We have one baby dedication. Amen. Amen. The Lord's will come this way. The Lord's. Amen. And we're going to dedicate baby Craig Angelo Lord Jr. Amen. Look at that. walking bow legged. I see you, boy. What is a baby dedication? A baby dedication is a ceremony in which Christian parents make a commitment before the Lord to submit their child to God's will and to raise the child according to God's word and God's way. Christian parents who dedicate a child are making a promise to the Lord to do everything within their power to raise the child in the fear and reverence of the Lord. Minister 
Johnson will read 1 Samuel chapter 1, verses 26 to 28. And she said, O my Lord, as thy soul liveth, my Lord, I am the woman that stood by thee here, praying unto the Lord. For this child I pray, and the Lord hath given me my petition, which I asked of him. Therefore also I have lent him to the Lord, as long as he liveth, he shall be lent to the Lord. And he worshiped the Lord there. Brother and sister Lord, today you are joining in a covenant with God and these witnesses that you will raise this child in God's house and in, God, in a godly home for God's glory. This service not for salvation, but only a dedication. It is your intention to present your child to the Lord and to pledge yourself to bring this child up in the fear of the Lord. Please answer by saying, we do. Do you dedicate yourself to God and to his church that Jesus died for? We do. do you dedicate yourself to raise your child in a godly home where Christ and the church are honored? We do. Do you recognize this child as a gift of God and thank him for this blessing? We do. Do you dedicate this child to the Lord? We do. Do you hear this day promise to live right before God and this child? We do. Do you hear this day ask God blessing upon this child's life to guide and direct him throughout the years. We do. God parent. Sister Mary. In the absence of this child, parents, do you promise to give your full support in this child upbringing? I do. In the absence of this child, parents, do you promise to do everything within your power to raise this child in the fear and reverence of the Lord? I do. Amen. Let me see. Mr. Black. Baby, can I baby to the ministers? Minister. Place your hands underneath the baby, and this is a baby. <laughs> Not a baby doll. Let's bow our heads in a word of prayer. Eternal God, we come right now to say thank you, Lord. Thank you. We come to dedicate this child, young Craig Angelo Lord Jr. We ask God that you touch this child in a mighty way right now. We dedicate him, God, that he will feel and see your spirit at a young age and receive you in his heart. We know, God, this is not a a gift of salvation right now, but only a dedication. But we do it in hopes that someday this child and their parents would uh, find Jesus in his heart. Yes. We ask God that you bless the parents, bless the father and the mother, that they will live right before this child. Yes. We ask God that they will be active in the church, that this child can see that God through their walking, through their work, and through their witness. We ask God that you allow this church to be a light in this child's eyes. We ask it all in your son Jesus' name. And the church said, Amen. I present to you baby Craig Angelo Lord Jr. Put your hands together and he's white on Easter Sunday. Amen. We'll now go right back into our service. A song? Amen. Do a song right now. Amen. Put your hands together for the, the youth choir. This is a day of celebration, is it not? How many, can, how many praise worshipers in the house? How many praise worshipers in the house? Let's take it back to the 70s. your joints. Come on, stand on your feet. Anybody, anybody, anybody that knows somebody? I got deliverance. Get up and tell everybody. It's praise time. Anybody that knows somebody? If you, I got deliverance. Get up and tell everybody. Uh, get your praise time. Listen, everybody on my right side. Everybody on my left side. Everybody in the choir stand. Yeah, the hush is at the door now. I got the preachers and the deacons. I got the preachers and the deacons. I got the preachers and the deacons. I got to do that praise, do that praise. Do 
I bet they do that pray, do that pray, do it. I bet they do that pray, do that pray, do it. I bet they do that pray, do that pray, do it. Daddy, die. Do that praise. Amen. As we come for our mission offering, amen. Amen. Come for our mission offering. Word of God says, make a joyful noise unto the Lord. All ye lands, serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know ye that the Lord, he is God, and not we ourselves. We are his people and the sheep of his pastor. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving and to his court with praise. Be thankful unto him. And bless his holy name, for the Lord is good. How many know today that the Lord, the Lord is good? His mercy is everlasting, but his truth endures to all, to all generations. Who died to set me free? What simple daddy mercy? I found out one day that, oh, how, oh, how I love him singing, oh, oh, singing, oh, how I love him because, mm, back to the top, there is, If you say it, you ought to sing the song. Everybody, everybody. Oh! 
To our feet, the word of prayer. As we stand to our feet. Sunday school, Heavenly Father. We thank you for that excellent event you allowed us to have, Heavenly Father. Can I hope you actually bless this offering that we used to uplift your kingdom. And Heavenly Father, we ask you to, use to see out your pastor's vision. Can I hope we ask you to give this pastor the word today so that he may say to somebody today so that they may come out saying, I yell, I yell, I can't take any more. Can I we ask you to allow somebody to say it today. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Because, because, because. Bless the Lord, somebody. Amen. It's greeting time, but don't move. If you move, you may lose your seat. Just hug your neighbor. Hug your neighbor. Say, good to be here. Tell a happy Easter, but I won't leave my seat. You just might miss your seat. If you move, you may lose. All the young folks back in the choir stand. All the young folks back in the choir stand. Get you back in the choir stand. Touch your neighbor and say, I belong to God. <laughs> they sleep, wake them up, say, I belong to God. You too. Amen. Come on, put your hands together one more time for this youth choir as they bless our hearts. Let us go back, 1934, at the cross. Come on down, Sister Jasmine. Come on, Sister Jasmine.
Can y'all help us say at the cross? New Belgium and our business put it together. thank God it was at the cross at the cross when I first saw the light amen because before the cross we was walking in darkness amen it was only because of what he did on a hill called Calvary shed his blood and died amen at the cross first giving honor to God to these preachers deacon and and deaconess and to all of you my brothers and sisters in Christ it's a blessing to be here in God's house today. Amen. Once again, continue to pray for Deacon Steele. We know that he's in the hospital. Amen. They had to rush into the hospital last night. Amen. And be in prayer for Sister Lewis. Amen. Her mom is in the hospital. Amen. He had to go into surgery today at 10 a.m. this morning. So let's be in prayer. But God is still able. How many know God is still able? Amen. <laughs> Yes, sir. He's still able to do what he said he's able to do. Don't forget, Bible study is still going on Tuesday night. Somebody say Tuesday night. Tuesday. Bible study is still going on. Don't forget, next Sunday is our early service, amen, but we go over to First Baptist, amen, uh, Lakeland. Church will start at 1, well, we'll get that 1.30 of feed us, and we're going to start early, amen. Somebody say early. early. Amen. Then we'll come back home, amen. Thursday night, the mighty men will be singing. 
and the third Sunday usher boy will be ushering. Amen? Amen. Amen. Let me just read these baptismal certificates who have been baptized. Amen. When I call your name, come forward. Uh, Denaria Powell. Denaria Powell. Amen. There you go. Brother Powell. Amen. Playing that French horn today. God bless it. Alvin Connor. Is Alvin Connor here? Alvin Connor. Alvin. Not here. Darnell Simmons. Darnell Simmons. Darnell Simmons. Come on. Come on down, dog. Amen. Come on down. Get it to him. Amen. And Sister Lunda Robinson. Lunda Robinson. Baptist certificate. Linda Robinson and DeShanae. I got it right. Glory to God. Shanae Robinson, God bless her. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Amen. And let me just acknowledge one of our new ushers who have joined the new usher, the Sunday school, the new youth usher board, Sister Kennedy Knight. Go ahead your hands, Sister Kennedy. God bless you. She's just looking. Amen. God bless you. Amen. We're not going to hold you long. At this time, we're going to go into prayer. Deacon Lyons. Come on and give us a word of prayer. And just come down for a word of prayer. And prayer is always in order as they come down. Amen. And, and if you missed the Easter program today, you missed a treat. Put your hands together for that wonderful Easter. Amen. Program. As we come, let's bow our heads and close our eyes and focus on Jesus. The song says he'll be a friend to the end. Have you heard? He'll be a friend until the end. Father God, we pause right in the middle of all the praise and the worship that's going on. He'll be a friend. We just came just to say thank you, Lord. Lord, we, we thank you because you've been a God that's been so good to us. Blessing us even though we sometimes get a disobedient. Be your friend. Be sometimes we always don't do the right thing, always don't say the right thing, but Lord, you still find it in your heart to bless us. So we just want to say thank you, Lord. Lord, we thank you for the laying down last night. The angels you just dispatched by our bedside to watch us while we sleep and slumbered. And you made old death behave just one more time, so I just want to say thank you. Knowing that somebody didn't get up this morning, and somebody woke up in the hospital this morning, and somebody lost a loved one from last night, but because of your grace and mercy, not because we've been so good, because the good that's in you saw to wake us up one more time. So I just want to say thank you right now, Lord. Yes. Thank you, Lord, because you gave us safe traveling grace to the church, the house of worship. And we found ourselves congregated together again. Came down to your altar because we know we need you. So we, we wanted to meet you right here at the altar with all of our situations. So we call on your holy name this morning because somebody know they need oh, you come this on, morning. Lions, come on. Somebody know that the only It'll way they can get this blessing that they need is from you, Lord. Lord, we just ask you to, to hear our pleas and hear our cries. And we know you hear the cry of the afflicted. So we just come, Lord, humbly before your throne just to say thank you, Lord. Lord, we already feel your presence in this place. These children has ushered you in in song. And Father, we ask you to continue to bless them during this service this morning. And Father, they came out this morning doing Sunday school. And they gave you their praise and their worship this morning. And right now, Lord, we just want to say thank you for these children right now, Lord. Keep them lifted up, Father. I know some parents just came to see their little kid on the program, but when they enter the door, we just pray that they hear something that might want to keep them here, Lord. Lord, we pray for this congregation this morning. Put us all on one accord. And let us be able to worship you in spirit and in truth. 
because we know we need you right now, Lord. And, and see, we came to praise you. We came to glorify you. We came to lift your name up. You are deserving, God. Yeah, so yeah, be yeah. With us this morning as we Come worship on, like. you this morning. Give us the spirit to call on your name this morning. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for just letting us be in your presence. Yes, Thank you for your spirit that's moving in this place right now. Keep us lifted up right now, Lord, because we want to glorify your holy name. You are deserving, God. We want to give you all that we got just to give it to you, Lord. Lord, yes. we know it. if we give you everything we got, it's still not enough to repay you. But yeah, if we yeah. just come in to worship with you, if we just come in to glorify you, we just want to give everything we got to you, Lord. We thank you right now, Master. Lord, we ask you to bless those ushers as they continue to usher people into this place. We pray that they can find a seat, Lord. And we thank you right now for their presence. We pray for the congregation. Put us on worm cords that we can praise you. It's all about you, Lord. It's all about you. It's not yeah, about us. Yeah. It's all about you. Right now, we pray and continue to bless this choir. Bless these musicians, Father. Uh, the talent that you gave them, they're not using it for bad purpose. They're using it to glorify you. So bless them right now, Lord. Now, Lord, we ask you to bless this man of God standing in that pulpit. Give him a word today. Somebody came to hear Easter, but he going to preach about you and what you did for us on the cross a long time ago. How you came down from glory. Come how on, you Lord. gave your life up for us. How you died on the cross. And how one morning you stepped out on resurrection ground. And when you got up, we was able to get up. We was able to get up from our sickness. We was able to get up from our heartaches. We was able to get up yeah, from yeah, all the pain yeah. and the agony that this world can give us. We just thank you right now, Lord, that we was able to get up this morning. Somebody wished they could have been here, but they couldn't be here because they couldn't get up. So we thank you for letting us get up this morning, Lord. Thank you for the moving in our bodies. Thank you for the food that you gave us, the clothing you gave us. Thank you for the roof over our head. Thank you, Lord, for the blood running warm in our veins. You've been such a good God. We just want to thank you right now. Lord, we pray somebody receive somebody's service. That somebody give their life over to you today. Somebody come running down this aisle. Say, that's enough for the world. I want to give my life to God. I want to turn myself over. Yeah, it's yeah. It's all about you, Lord. Lord, we ask you to accept them with open arms. We thank you right now, Lord. And Lord, we pray for the sick of this house. Pray for Deacon Steele. Yeah. Sister Steele. Yeah. Sister Henderson, who's going through some things with her family. Yeah. We pray for all those who lost loved ones. Pray for all those who loved ones are sick. Some are standing right now, haven't told anybody how they feel. They got sickness in their body right now. But they brought it down to the altar. And they're going to turn it over to you. Come on, Lord. They know you are yeah. healing. You got healing power. So, right now, Lord, we calling on it right now. Uh -huh, uh -huh. We ask you right now. Bless in this place. Yes, sir. Everybody individually and all of us collectively. And Father, we're going to be ever mindful to give you all the honor, all the glory, and all the praise. In your holy son Jesus' name, we You'll all be. pray. Amen. 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 He'll be your friend. Uh -huh. Oh, have you heard? Have you heard? Have you heard? Have you heard? Not only that, he'll be your Lord until the end. Have you heard? Have you heard? He'll be your Lord. He'll be your Lord. Have you oh, heard? Lord, have you heard? Have you heard? Come on and bless the Lord, somebody. Amen. Have you heard? Amen. We thank God for that powerful prayer. Amen. Amen. At this time, we'll go right into our tithe and our offering. Amen. Deacons will come. Usher will come.
He's all. He's all over me. And he's keeping Going for going Deacon Ronan. Dear Heavenly Father, we come this morning to say thank you, Father. Father, we thank you for what you've done for us so many years ago, Father, by raising from the dead, Father. Father, we just ask that you continue to keep blessing this talent that we have among us within our church, Father. Keep touching our kids each and every day, Father. We know that it's for the parents, Father, that we have to keep bringing these kids to church, Father. Father, we just want to thank you for this offering that it lifts up this kingdom, Father. And we ask all these things in your daughter and son in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. He's on the left, he's on the right, and front and back, underneath, over me, and he's living down his... He's on the right, front, front and back. Her life is on the right, and front and back, underneath, over me, and he's living down his side. He's on the left. Come on, he's all, he's all over me, he's all over me. He's all over me, yeah. He's all over me. He's all, he's all over me. 
Amen. Somebody say he all over me. Amen. He keeping me alive. Amen. The reason why we're still alive because of what he's doing in our lives. Amen. He's all over me and keeping me alive. Amen. Right before we sing our next song, we invite your attention to the gospel according to John. John chapter 20, verses 19 through, amen, 29. John chapter 20, verses 19 through 29. Just hold it there, and after the choir has blessed our hearts one more time, amen. We'll come back, and Durante Weah will be reading our scriptures today. Amen. Amen. I don't see him, but he better have his Bible in his hand. <laughs> amen. Amen. So after we sung the song, Amen. Durante, we're reading our scriptures today. Amen? Amen. He's worthy to be what? Praise. He's worthy to be what? Praise. He's worthy to be what? Praise. Come on, let's give him some praise. Come on, church. Come on, church. Come on, church. God. 